it's December 2nd and I'm the numbers lady and we are doing a little number walk here in the house because we decorated so much for the holidays. And I want to talk today about all of these nutcrackers that are sitting here on the shelf and let's see how we can count them. Two is with me and since we're in our own house we will take our masks off because it's our own little pod. So we will take the masks off, you two too. It is the 12th month, and it's the second day of the 12th month. Yay! Two says it's my day. So we're back to single units since yesterday, single digit days. Yesterday was the 1st of December. Today is the 2nd of December. This is an even number two is the, the one prime even number. All right, so let's look at all these nutcrackers I have and see what we know about. What makes them a nutcracker? That's a really good question. So, and you know, there's the Nutcracker Ballet, which is the Tchaikovsky Christmas Ballet, Holiday Ballet, that anybody who does ballet will always be in sometime because it's on everywhere around the world during the holiday season. So let's look at this one here. This one is the Ceramicus. Look, he's got, a, he's got his little wheel and it goes round and round. Look at that. Okay, and his heart, he's got his tool to make, to make the bowls and his tools to work on it. But what makes them a nutcracker is that the mouth moves and you could put your nut in there. You see the handle mechanism, it goes up and down so that you could actually put a nut in and you could crack it. That is a nutcracker. So that one's a nutcracker. This one's a nutcracker for sure. It looks like a, somebody almost in London at, at the uh, uh, gates and he's got a nutcracker mouth there too, you see? Now, even the little ones are nutcrackers. Look at this, the little tiny ones, okay? Let's see what else. This little one, small little nutcracker. This guy, he's Mr. Salt and Pepper. Look at that, he's got salt, pepper, he's got a couple of candy cane things here and he's got some more and he is a nutcracker, look at that. This one has got the little cookies and all the stuff. He's the chef and he is a nutcracker. See how his mouth goes in and out? He can put them in there. You can also, if you put a little bit of a, of a, a little uh, smell thing in here, it can actually burn and come up with some smell. But I didn't do that yet. And I probably won't because I wanna make sure we don't have any issues. This one's also a little nutcracker. And here, to get needs to get out of the way a little bit, okay. This one's also a nutcracker, this little one. It'd be little tiny nuts. All of these are nutcrackers, and here is our artist, look at him. Does he have a little, yeah, there he goes. He kind of, you know, French painter, look at this. So he's the painter, and he's got all his little, in his palette here with the colors. All right, so there he is. These are some more. These were actually made as tree designs, but I, they're all little nutcrackers. See, they, you could hang them on a tree, but I put them all out with all my little nutcrackers here. And this is another one who matches pretty much the one on the other end. And he's a big nutcracker. He looks more, these are the most typical nutcrackers from the ballet. Now, what about these? He looks like a nutcracker, but it's a candle. So he doesn't crack nuts but he's in the shape of a nutcracker, same as this one and same as this one. These two are actually the same, they're twins. So how many nutcrackers do we actually have? And you can sort them by size and you can sort them by whether or not they actually have a nutcracker part to them. So we clearly have one, two, three, four, five really big ones. We have one sort of middle size one here, and we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine small ones that are designed to go on trees. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine that were designed to go on trees as decorations, one middle size, and one, two, three, four, five very large ones. And we have three candle look like nutcrackers. So you can decide how to sort them and to how to count them. Two, what do you think? Should we count the candles? No, they're candles. They look like nutcrackers, but you couldn't really crack a nut. Now I understand these little ones would be really hard to crack a nut, 
but they actually have the mechanism to do that, which means they open in the back and they open their mouth so you could put a teeny, teeny, teeny little nut in there. Okay. So to be a real nutcracker, you have to actually have, uh oh, look at this one. He doesn't have a thing in the back, so he's not really a nutcracker. We'll put him over here. We'll have to change our counts. How about this one? Yes. And this one? Yes. So now we only have three over here that really are nutcrackers. He's really only a decoration that looks like one. Let's check all of them here. This one also does not really crack nuts, has no little handle. This one does. This one does. And does the last one, let's see. Yes. So we have three here that are really nutcrackers, three there that are really nutcrackers, two that are wood soldiers, and three that are candles that look like them. So let's count again. We have one, two, three, four, five really big nutcrackers, one middle-sized nutcracker, one, two, three, four, five, six small little nutcrackers, and this one, so six, seven. We have seven little nutcrackers. We have two wooden soldiers that look like nutcrackers, and one, two, three candles that look like nutcrackers. So you can sort and count, and that's really important to understand counting. You need to know what the units are, sort them, figure out what you're trying to count, because if you only care that they look like a nutcracker, you don't care whether it works, you could count everything, even the candles. But if you really want those that have the handle as if you could crack a nut, whether you physically could or not, then that's one category. And if you want to know the ones that could really put a nut in, it might have to really be only the big ones. This is the numbers lady, how to count. We've got nutcrackers and know about the nutcracker ballet by Tchaikovsky, which I'm sure will be on TV and will be various channels and will be performed lots of places that maybe you can see on the television because you can't go see them this year. We'll see you tomorrow. It'll be the 3rd of December and it's bye-bye from number two. See you tomorrow.